What's up guys, Hobo88 here, and welcome back to R Factor. We're doing some more big block modified racing by request of the wild child. Um, he asked whether or not I could run big block modifieds as the Pascal number three at Orange County. So looking at what I'm seeing, I believe this might be the right car. Uh, Pascal Racing Products, number three, big block modified. One of my favorites, LJ Lombardo's car. And I love this car. Uh, I think it looks awesome. So hopefully I've got the right one here. But um, we're going to go ahead and run this at Orange County. So i uh, got the track ready to go. It's one of uh, Travis Pullen's tracks. And um, 5 8 third mile. And it's a pretty cool track. So we've got the big blocks loaded. And the AI, maybe a skosh too high at 100 from the test that I did. Uh, rolling start. 20 laps sounds good to me. 18 cars all good so let's go ahead and load up the track and while we do that as well i will quickly grab up my logitech profiler and just show you guys my profiler settings for my g27 which is just that and we'll go back in here and take a look at the in-game settings once this loads up um all right, so that's the garage. We've got our difficulty rates uh, all set, or difficulty options all set to off, except for the invulnerability. And in the rates section, we've got the following. So this is what I'm running with my G27. Pause this screen if you need to copy these uh, these details across, but hopefully you guys find that useful. As for the setup, uh, I think I'll shorten the gears a skosh and leave everything else the same. I like the default setup for the big blocks. So let's go ahead, head out on track, and cut a few laps. So it's a pretty good, a pretty good track again. The mod is well realized. There's lots of detail. Hey, there's our hauler, and someone else was parked at it. What's going on? Um, the AI are having a bit of a moment here in the pits, but uh, you can see it's well thought out, as is always the case with these mods. All the infield pit area looking good. And even beyond the fence looks pretty good as well from what I can see. We've got trees and houses, buildings, bits and pieces. Let's get up to speed, cut a few laps. We'll go into the race. And this one has been one of the long awaited requests on the channel. Uh oh, uh oh, where's that car going? <laughs> Uh, this request has been sitting on my list for quite a long time. We're finally getting around to it now. Even the lighting out in what would be the car park, I guess, behind the stand here on the main straight looks really cool. Cars parked out to the back there on the right as well. And there's more of these lights up here over turn three and four. Is that what they are? Are they lights? what they are but a very cool facility by the look of it sounds like it'd be a good one to go and visit Trying to figure out the lines. Bottom's pretty good. What I've seen, I think the AI tend to run around the mid middle to the top. So if I'm going to come from the back of the pack, I'm probably going to need to go to the bottom. Much to my disgust. Whoa. You guys know that I only like to sit up on the fence. But every now and then, we just have to settle for the fence around the bottom. Yeah, got that wrong. Too slow. We were doing okay, and now we've forgotten what we were doing. It's a bit better. Much nicer line through there that time. Oh, overcommitted. Overcommitted. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look at the replay. That'll do it for uh, embarrassing myself there for the moment. 
And uh, we'll take a look at this number three big block modified cool looking car. And uh, we get a bit better view actually of outside the track here too. Yeah, looks good. It's very immersive. That's the thing I like about this track. And sure, there's a lot going on. There's a lot of stuff to look at, but uh, I find it immersive. So another good one. Got the Ferris wheel happening out there. Outside of turn four by the look of it too. There's where we completely goofed and slammed the wall. This is the one where we completely goofed and just went way too slow. <laughs> what a rookie. All right. I think that'll do it. We'll just watch this last run through three and four. That's much better. All right. Next session. Skip. And skip again to the race. We'll start from the back of the pack, as we always do. 20 laps. We'll see what we can do here. This guy's got a problem. You're stuck in the fence, good sir. There we go. Alright. Can we do it? Can we go from last to first? I'm not confident. But I'm thinking that this is going to be good fun regardless. So we head around on the pace lap. ready here. Pull the belts tight. 20 laps at Orange County Big Block Modifieds. Hope you guys enjoy it. Oh, bit of a shot car behind us. Right there, yeah, so they're all running high. So it looks like we've got to go to the bottom. If we're going to go anywhere at all. Understeer, understeer. That sucked. Oh! It's one of the things I hate about the AI in R Factor. We need to actually pay attention here. We're getting left behind already. There's not much room up there. Red Hearn running at the back. I don't feel so bad now. Very hard to get the momentum to make a pass. Try and get a good run down off the exit of the corner. Oh, oh, rotor wheel. Fed into the fence. There's just not enough room up the top to do it. So we can stick with them, but we just can't get past as we slide up the inside there. Two sideways into three, but we get the good exit. We're good off the turns. We're not very good through in and through, but we're good on the corner exits. Oh my god, I was not expecting him to be so low on the track there. over under. It's on.
Oh, I thought I had him cleared. Apparently not. Left us a little bit more room on the top this time. Oh, there was no room at all. That was awesome. Down here in three and four is the real struggle. Up on the top. Turn three is a little tight on the cushion. Enough. There's just not enough room. Understeer. Oh man, that's why we've got the invulnerability turned on, because we suck. So we're still at the back, and we cannot move forward, we cannot hold a position. It's too fast through the entry of the turn. Slam the wall. No, no, we're good. Gonna get a king run off the corner. Can only do this high to low business while we're at the back. Can't change lanes like this and there's someone behind you. Oh! Didn't expect to clear that car. We're back to the over-under crisscrossing again. Oh! And that's going to be it now. I don't think we'll catch him again now before the check is... I just didn't want to finish last. <laughs> I think in overall lap speed we are better, but... Just not in the right spots, that's the chequered flag right there. So we end up finishing last. Hugely disappointing, but... Um, with that being said, the track is still extremely good. Extremely good fun. And... Uh, the AI are actually really quite good here, like... Sure, I couldn't pass them, but you know, they were and they were good. They were fairly consistent. They were just a little too strong on the corner entry, but otherwise they were pretty good. So it was a fun race. It was a shame that we couldn't go a little better, but uh, it was still very good fun. Lots of side by side racing. So good fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter at Hobo88 for all the latest. And uh, that's it for the video. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you the next one.